Hey, sweetheart. Working late again? I'm sorry, Jessica. I have to finish reading this by the end of the weekend. Well, I've got a better place for you to do it. Check it out. A Victorian spa hotel. Well, I definitely can't say no to that. Especially when it's our first anniversary. Let's go. James, what is that? Why is this car here? The windows are so dirty. It looks like someone must have abandoned it. Literally anything could be inside. Do you have a bat or a hammer with you? Here, take the trunk key. I'll watch from here if you don't mind. That car creeps me out. Victorian Spa Hotel? That's where we're spending the weekend. This poor couple must have been coming from the hotel. We should go and let the staff know that they didn't make it home. This place looks amazing. Good evening and welcome to the Victorian Spa Hotel. Hello. Uh, I'm afraid we've got some sad news. We came across a car on our way here. Uh, unfortunately, the passengers are dead. It looks like they were guests of your hotel. Don't worry. I'll inform the police. But first, I need to take care of our living guests and show you to your room. Please, follow me. Your treatment starts in 20 minutes, miss. I'll come for you later. Thank you. I can't wait to get a massage and forget about the awful things we saw today. Let's try not to think about the bad start to our vacation and just enjoy our time here. What do you say? I bet all these spa treatments are going to feel heavenly. My first one is booked for this evening. I'm just sad we have to go separately. Oh, by the way, I found this in the pocket of my bathrobe. I hope I didn't break anything when I changed.
It's time to go, miss. I'm coming. See you later, hon. It's been three hours already. Jessica was supposed to be back an hour ago. I'd better go find her. This weekend doesn't seem like the right time to propose. I wouldn't want Jessica remembering such an important day as the same day we found two dead bodies. I'd better keep the ring for a better time.
Excuse me? Uh, have you seen a dark-haired girl around here? I guess I shouldn't bother him. He doesn't look well. Excuse me? Uh, have you seen a dark-haired girl around here? I guess I shouldn't bother him. He doesn't look well. Hello? Have you seen a young woman with dark hair and bright eyes? Her name's Jessica. Is she your fiancé? Oh, of course I saw her, but uh, my throat's so dry. Could you bring me some warm tea, dear? So, how do you know Jessica? Where is she? 
His hotel is pretty big, and I can't find her anywhere. Oh, Jessica's my friend. She's not here, of course. I always wanted to become a nurse, you know. Let me tell you about it. My father and his best friend built this hotel. It's very brave of him to make such an investment, now that we're nearing the end of the 19th century. <laughs> I'm so proud of him. My father's the best physician in our state, you know. Last week, he assigned me as the head nurse. I've been asking him for the position since I turned 18. My fiancé is quite smart as well. He's about to invent a cure that will save everyone. My father doesn't want me to marry him, though. What a pity. This old lady seems a bit out of her mind. She didn't tell me a thing about Jessica. I'll have to find a way to the spa wing and find her myself. Jessica, is that you? Excuse me, miss. Where are you going? Show me your treatment referral, please. Oh, I'm sorry. I think I left mine in the room. 
I'm afraid you're not allowed in, sir. Only guests who are assigned to treatment may enter the spa wing.
Hello? James, I love. J Jessica? Is that you? What happened? You really must relax before your treatment, sir. What... what happened? My hands! Oh no! Doctor, please help me. This place, it's killing me. I was so young and strong before, but now, please, I need my medicine. It's in the fridge. My doctor always checks my blood pressure. Here's the prescription. Please help me. Josephine? Where's my Josephine? Her father didn't approve of me proposing to her, but nothing will keep us apart. She's so loyal and gentle. She always supports me. I've made a great discovery. Now her father will have to believe I'm worthy of her. Time flies. I need to go finish my work. I'm 
busy. So much to do. Very important. <laughs> <laughs>